Hi, I'm John Meehan, President and Owner of Lake Erie Rubber. In this video, I'm going to talk about the properties of silicone. What are some advantages in using this material, and what are some disadvantages when using it? And at the end of the video, I'll go over some products that are made right here at Lake Erie Rubber from silicone. Silicone comes in three forms. The first one is known as HCR, which is high consistency rubber. That's the one that we're going to be talking about. Uh, the second is liquid silicone rubber. And the third is RTV, which is room temperature vulcanizing rubber, which is what you could get at a hardware store. Silicone is well known for being used in medical products, baby products, um, and also food products. And that's because it's a very inert material, which means that it doesn't interact or cause any chemical reaction with materials that it comes into contact with. The advantages when using silicone, number one, it's hypoallergenic, it's biocompatible. And like I mentioned, the inert nature of silicone as a material makes it great for food applications and medical applications because it's not going to interact with the materials that it comes into contact with. The second thing, silicone is really good for extreme temperature sealing applications. And that's because it has excellent low temperature flexibility and great heat resistance. So silicone will maintain its original physical properties at temperatures as extreme as minus 150 degrees Fahrenheit and up to 570 degrees Fahrenheit. And the last advantage that I'll mention is that it has good flame resistance and it's also non-toxic if it is burned. The main disadvantage that comes to mind when I think about silicone is the physical strength properties. It has a low tensile strength and does not have good abrasion resistance uh, and it also has a low tear strength when you compare it to other rubber materials. A second disadvantage when using silicone is the price. It's very expensive, but in certain applications it is necessary because of the advantages that it has. And then one last consideration when you're thinking about using a silicone is that it's more permeable to gases than most other rubbers, which is something that just needs to be considered. Now let's talk about a few products that are made right here at Lake Erie Rubber out of silicone. And again, this is the HCR, high consistency rubber silicone. The first one that we'll cover is a silicone ring. And this ring is used to seal the glastic container of a rectifier in a locomotive. And the reason to choose silicone for this part is because of its high temperature uh, resistance. This product in the rectifier sees very high temperatures and silicone is able to maintain its shape and its properties and its flexibility even in those extreme temperatures which makes it a very good choice for this application. The second one that we'll talk about is a light seal for a transit locomotive. And this one, again, similar uh, reason to choose silicone, this part is a seal that sees very high temperatures and has to maintain uh, flexibility and a good seal, even though it's going to be exposed to really high temperatures. And the third product, this is actually just another type of light seal for a transit locomotive. So again, same reason, but anytime we have an application where we know that the temperatures will be really extreme or it's critical that the product does not interact with materials, silicone is usually the first material that we'll explore as an option for that application. If you have any questions or you just need more help, please go to lakeerierubber.com and use one of the many ways to get in touch with us.